Hey guys, so currently we are in Bitcoin and it seems like uh, Bitcoin has been showing a lot of bearish uh, indicators. Okay, so I'll explain about these bearish indicators in this video right now. So in my Twitter account, I've explained about it already. Uh, basically the median line failure, this is the primary bearish indicator that I'm seeing in Bitcoin right now. Okay, so I've explained how it works here, but um, just, just to show uh, everyone in this video, um, I have shown out the chart of Bitcoin here. So uh, if I were to use the Pitchfork 2, and the Pitchfork 2 is right here, okay? You can, you can find this uh, in trading view. So if I were to use this tool and I were to draw the uh, pivot from here, A, B, and C, what we are seeing is the median line failure, okay? Where the price does not touch the median line after going towards it, okay? And you can see this gap from, from the top of this wick to this uh, white color line here, and this is the median line, okay? So there's a lack of interaction um, when the price tries to go towards the median line, and this is a very bearish indicator. Okay, and normally uh, the textbook price target for this kind of uh, failures is the pivot C. Okay, so the pivot C is right here. Uh, it's around the price of 59.6k. Okay, so um, yeah, I've explained this in the, the Twitter post already. Um, it's most likely going to reach towards that level. Okay, uh, for now. So that's the first indicator um, that I've explained um, in my Twitter. So one of the second things that I didn't really explain in, uh, in my Twitter is this uh, hourly four, 200 hourly four SMA. Okay, um, the price has already rejected it like almost three to four times. Okay, you can see this week one, two, three, four. There's so many rejections uh, from the bottom of this hourly four SMA. Yeah, and that's also quite bearish. Okay, so um, currently I'm uh, expecting 60k for now. Okay, now if you if you check my other posts, I've actually explained um, that to, that Bitcoin might reach the price of 50k, possible. Okay, so um, I've done this uh, explanation about April 5th, which is about one month ago. Yeah, so that's quite long ago. Uh, I've basically stated that 50k might be the price target for Bitcoin. Okay, and I've also explained why. So if I go to another chart of Bitcoin, and this is one of the main reasons why I believe uh, there's going to be some temporary um, bearishness in Bitcoin. Okay, so this is one of the big uh, median lines that you can draw from pivot uh, A is uh, in the bear market of 2021 uh, up to pivot C, which is the top of uh, 2021 and also the bottom of 2022. And you can draw a pitchfork here, okay, a regular pitchfork. So the same one that I've drawn just now. Um, it's from here, one, two, three, right? Yeah, and you can see that the price of Bitcoin currently rests right at the median line. Okay, now there is some good news here is that um, the price did not uh, turn away from the median line before it even interacted with it. Okay, like what we're seeing right now, there is a lack of interaction of the median. Okay, so normally when this happens, pivot C is the target. So, uh, um, we are not seeing this kind of failure in the bigger picture, okay, which is very good news. That means um, the chances of the pivot C being hit, which is 15K, is uh, very unlikely. Okay, This will never happen um, with this kind of setup. So um, that's a good news right here. So that's why I think that uh, Bitcoin is going to be going into a, a temporary bear market, very temporary. Okay, um, yeah. So basically not bullish for now, but um, still within the bull market. That is what my, my belief is. Okay, so uh, yeah, so just basically, I just explained Bitcoin. You know the price um behavior right now seems bearish, um, but not long term bearish. Okay, just very short term bearish. Yeah, so this is my update for today. Uh, if you like this video, uh, like and subscribe this uh, uh video and also my channel. Uh, um, there's a lot of updates there. Also, my Twitter account has uh, even more updates. So everything that I've done in the past um month. Mostly has been done through Twitter. Okay, so you can check this out. Uh, a lot of updates here. Also on other things like NVIDIA. You know, yeah, mostly I, I'll be updating every single day. So you can check this out. Yeah, uh, that's it for today. Uh, see you next time.